Okay, I'm gonna give you the inside scoop of what to do and what not to do when trying to do the pumpkin head trend. First, get a bigger pumpkin than you actually think. Second, don't use a plastic bag, use a beanie. Because the pumpkin I got the first time was too small, I had to go back to the store and get a bigger pumpkin. For the kids' pumpkins, I obviously didn't use a real pumpkin because that would be way too heavy. I picked up these foam carvable ones at Target. They were 10 bucks each, but I got them on sale, so it was a really good deal. And then I just printed off these eyes, nose, and mouth from the computer, and then I carved it out, and then made sure the open was quite large at the bottom because I obviously did not want this to happen to us. This white pumpkin was for a baby girl and the orange pumpkin was for my toddler. For my pumpkin, my husband helped me cut out the bottom and scooped out all of the guts and then I went to work cutting a face on it. My toddler absolutely loved his and he wore it around the house all day. We went at night, right after sunset, I put a beanie on baby girl and then we got into position. I had a tripod set up filming us right now, but I had my husband have my camera and he took some pictures of us. And then it was time to 